Welcome to the part 3 of how to detect a face using OpenCV in Python. So in the previous tutorial we detected a face uh, in the image and in this tutorial we will be detecting the eyes and maybe the nose and the mouth. So before we proceed I want to show you one thing. So now as we have already detected the face so if you remember in the, from the previous video now we need to change the region of interest for our image in order to detect the eyes and the nose and mouth. So to detect the eyes, nose and mouth we won't be looking in the complete image but instead we will be only looking for these features inside the region of the face. So I want to show you one thing. So uh, we have the coordinates for our face in this list. So uh, let me show you the region of how we will be changing the region of interest for the eyes, nose and mouth. So first of all we will check if the length of the list is equal to 4 since we return the 4 points here. So if uh, there is no face detected the length will be 0 ok so uh, that's why we need to uh, place this condition here so if the length is great uh, is equal to 4 what we need to do is we, uh, let's update the image and to crop the image what we need to do is we need to pass the uh, coordinates like this like if you want to crop the image to 4 pixels from x and 4 pixels from y we will do something like this x plus 4 and y uh, from y column y plus 4 ok so since the x here is the is at the 0th index of this list and the y is at the first index and this uh, for uh, the the pixels we want to add in x are the width which is at the second index and the height is at the third index okay so what we will do here instead is uh, let me copy this so instead of this x coordinate and the coordinate for x uh, okay so uh, my bad i kind of mixed things up Instead of y here, uh, x here, the first parameter is for the y and the second parameter is for the x. Okay, my bad, I mix up this stuff there. So y is at the first index, and y is again here at the first index, and uh, we will replace 4, uh, 4 by the height, which is at the third index, right? So we will type here 3 and for the x the index will be 0 and here x plus the width which is at the 0 1 2 second index ok so now we have updated the image and we have cropped it so let's see how this works so as you can see here the complete image has been cropped to detect my face only and as I am moving around the region of interest, uh, the region of interest for our, our image is being changed. So now it is detecting my face only. So basically, what we need is we need this region of interest. Uh, we need this image. In this image, we need to detect the eyes and the mouth and the nose. So let me rename this as ROI underscore image, and that is pretty much it. Now the only thing we need to do is just as the face cascade uh, we need to load the eyes cascade and the name for that file is r cascade underscore i dot xml okay so we have already loaded it and now what we need to do is pass the classifier here and uh, the last thing what we need to do is well uh, we need to do one more thing since we are not using this image let's remove this return okay 
and also from here let's remove this written and let me run the code to see if everything is working correctly no so it is missing one parameter at line 33 32 okay yes definitely let me pass it let me see if removing the image okay so it is working fine uh, fine so i have removed the uh, image from this return statement okay so now uh, so now what we need to do is I've, all, uh, I've only cropped the image here and I've loaded the classifier here so the last thing we need to do is detect the eyes so let me paste it here and I'll pass instead of passing the image we will pass the ROI image okay and instead of passing the face cascade classifier we will pass the image cascade classifier here let me change the color to red and the label to eyes and the, the parameters which were working uh, well for this is the scaling factor was 1.1 and I found, I found that the minimum numbers of 14 was working pretty well for this okay so now let's run the code and as you can as you can see here now it is detecting my eyes pretty well so now let's uh, also add the face uh, sorry the mouth and nose classifier so let me rename the variables because i'm too lazy to type nose and mouth and the name for uh, the file for the nose is now N A R I Z. I don't know why they named it. It's such a weird name. And mouth.xml. And we also need to increase the variables here. So mouse cascade and mouth cascade. And also we need to pass them here. So it will save some time instead of. Uh, typing it out okay so the last thing what we need to do is just as we uh, we have already updated the ROI so basically the region of interest for the nose and the mouth will be the same as for the eyes because they all lie and inside a face so let me just copy this line again and again and uh, here we will type uh, instead of I, I cascade, we will type the nose cascade here and the mouse uh, mouth cascade here, and the label will be nose and the label will be one uh, one thing mouse. It's mouth. I don't know. It's so weird. The color is green, and we will be needing one more color because we are out of colors. We have only defined three colors, so. I don't know, I guess it will be this color will be somewhere around pink. I'm not sure, but uh, let's see. I don't, I don't know what color is this actually. I don't, uh, well, let's make it a white, okay? So the mouth will be uh, detected with white color, and now let's come back to the parameters. So the scaling factor for the nose, which I found was working good, is uh, what was that again? Uh, okay, so the scaling factor for the nose, which I used, was uh, 1.1 again, and for the mouth also I use the scaling factor of 1.1 but here I, I the mini I updated the minimum neighbors with 20 and nose with 4 okay so now let's run our code and see how well it is working okay so as you can see it is detecting my eyes and face pretty, pretty accurately and also my mouth but there's a I don't it is working good with the nose too but I don't Feel so good with the nose and also with the mouth. So I guess I will update the nose to uh, let's say 10 and let's rerun the code. Okay, so 10 is not working that well. 
4 was working much better so let me update it with 5 and yes it is working pretty good now and for the mouth it is some at some point at some points it is confusing my eyes my eye with the mouth uh, i guess when i blink my eye it uh, yes when i blink my eye it confuses my eye with the mouth but uh, but if we talk about the overall performance of this script it is working pretty decent and i guess it is doing the uh, the face uh, face detection pretty good so you can play around with these uh, with these parameters to make it uh, quite even better so if you have any problems or if you have any issues you can uh, drop a comment or if you want me to make a video or tutorial related to some specific uh, uh, topic you can also drop a comment below and don't forget to subscribe my channel and uh, thank you for watching take care in the sky gazing far into the night I raise my hand